Hi everybody. Welcome back. Hopefully this does not tip over. I figured out how to, I hope. I have my other thing over there where you tip it upside down. That's, but that's for my actual camera. But um, I want to, I have got a ton of videos that I can do on this channel for December. <laughs> um, I have not finished last year's December daily. It's right here on the floor. Hence why I have to use the box because I have these and I can buy another one. But all of 2019 is in here. I've got the book done. I just have to put the pictures in and everything. And then 2018 is done also. But I think yeah, the picture, I put the pictures in the pages where they go. I just have to cut them and mount them and all of that stuff. But it's huge. I have, well, I have Christmas cards that we got that makes the book bigger. And I usually hook those somewhere else. I don't put them in there. I could put them in there. But by the, by the, the rate I'm going with all these December dailies, my October dailies aren't as thick. So these notebooks work great. And I use, let me show you what I use. This might be a long video, guys. I use these, the snap ones, and they usually come with some inserts and all of that in there. I take all that out. I just use the book. And I wanted a green one this year. I couldn't find red. I usually try to get the black ones, the black like this for October. Um, and do it that way unless I go to my thrift store and find one that's similar to this and I'll use it but this one's been sitting look at it look at it it's kind of but this is gonna end up being I should do two I don't want to do two I could get another notebook and put 2019 on it and insert all the cards the Christmas cards and stuff you know the extra stuff I could do that that's a possibility. So anyway, I'm like two years behind. I don't know about anybody else. I was pretty good at this, but I am slacking big time. I don't know what it is this last year. I don't have motivation. I don't have none of that. And because of that, things have had gone to pot. But I do keep things in like, that's in a tub. You know, I've got my October daily on my desk here and last year's. Like all the pictures are there. I just gotta go in and put it in there. But I'm only behind one year on that one. I just gotta do two, finish 2019 and do this year's. But I have a pro some projects this December that I wanna do that I didn't do last year. So that'll be fun. Anyway, this is a December daily. This year, I, I don't have another one of those container things. So I have, I kind of ripped up the box and stuff. Everything that I want to use is in here. That's what I do when I start thinking about this, which is usually in the springtime, believe it or not. It's in the spring. I will go in and buy my book for December and October. So I have them, so I'll have two boxes or two, whatever. I'll start putting stuff in there. So I have my, bo my book, and I'm using green. I don't know why I decided on green, because most everything this year is going to be red. I don't know why. I can paint it red. but So I want to show you what I usually do. I usually make a list. And I found somebody's cover. I didn't write down where it was. I saw it somewhere, probably on Pinterest. I don't know. But I like the way it was, like there was a huge, there was a doily here, Merry Christmas, or whatever. I put daily here, so I know it's for the December daily. I made a little drawing. So there's a stocking, elf, uh, Christmas presents. It's the cover, and I should have took a picture of it, and I probably did, but I bet it's on my, this plaid paper, that's why those the squares it's plaid paper which is what I, I, that's my idea for the cover 
So that's what I usually do is I'll make a little drawing or I'll see it from somebody else. But I have um, a shaker page, what I wanna put in it. Um, white wood paper, white wood, red stripe, plaid. That's what I put for paper. And I can usually go through my own paper first. And it's all my books are always usually mix and match papers. Um, new this year, I wanted to do the 12 days before Christmas, you know, like the book on the 12th day before, you know what I mean? Like the book, I wrote that on here. Um, Christmas PJs, Advent calendar, baby it's cold outside, gingerbread, reasons why, these are pages, okay? The tree, a shaker page, first, a Christmas list, where it be, what you want for Christmas, you know what I mean, or a Christmas list. Um, reasons why, uh, baby it's cold outside, that's, so that would be like a hot cocoa page. Advent um, calendar, which I always put in the beginning. Um, like for her October one, I made an Advent um, calendar thing, but I buy the chocolate one, the book for her. So it's probably that, that's probably what I'm thinking of for that. Christmas PJs. I never get Christmas PJs. I want to do something different this year. So I got the numbers I want to use in here. I want to use uh, wood looking ones. And I'm like, how am I going to do that? I can either find them or whatever. Well, guess what? My Dollar Tree had the wood numbers. I bought, and I'll go through all this with you. Um, washi tape. I have not got that yet. I don't think. I will feel off of what I have already and put it in here. And I don't see washi tape in here. So if that's something I need to get, I need to get on the ball. I have washi tape on my cart, but I think I want to find a farmhouse one. I don't know, I'll have to, I don't know what I was thinking there. A uh, ribbon, I've got uh, a whole bunch of ribbon over there. I'm not worried about that. Ephemera, I got some of that in here. Buttons, I've got a couple of those. Tape, glue, punch, red burlap, which I have. So this, I write down ideas and write it down. And so that's how I start out. So we'll put that over here in the book. <laughs> I have some red and white doilies. Remember I was saying something about a doily on here. And I didn't write down here if it was red or white but I think I was thinking the red and I knew I had some so I have red those usually come out on uh, thanks uh, not Thanksgiving Valentine's Day but and I knew I had some so I, I found those I've got some little white ones we'll use those okay I bought cage protectors because I'm going to need there's ten in here so I try to do one day per one of these. So when you open it, you'll have this page and this page. Well, this will be page one, this will be page two. You flip it three, four, you know what I mean? So if I have to put extras in, I will do special inserts if I wanna put more pictures. So I think I bought enough for the um, 25 days and then I'll do I'll put I skip usually the 26th 27th and 28th of December and I put New Year's Eve in here but I skip the other days usually unless something's happening which I know this year it won't but um, I will do the month of December so there's my pages I need to put in here's some alphabet Um, ones that I have. I don't know why I took these out specifically. It's just the alphabets, I think. I don't know, in case I need them or whatever. Here's the numbers. I had to figure out how many numbers I needed. So I had, I put, I got these little bins. Oh, that's what it is. I have, this is one, I got one, two, 
four, five, three, four, five, sevens. I got all the numbers here. One through zero through nine. And I think when I did this, I figured out, I wrote down the numbers on a piece of paper to how many I needed. And I think I needed two more packages of this, so I got two more packages. So I have enough numbers to do my numbers. One through whatever. I think I have enough. I hope I do. Um, I'll have to go through and do that again. I don't remember. Okay, I did buy some paper this year. I bought this one is Christmas Farmhouse. This one, this one is Christmas Market. Another one did I get? This one I had. Okay. All right. I had these two. Let me show you some of the things. I bought a bunch of ephemera. This is the Farmers Frames and Tags Cartabella. I love Cartabella paper. I have found out that I tend to go towards that brand and there's also recollection here that's this one echo park okay so i got i want to do my black and white farmhouse this year i'm going outside my comfy but this has you know it has it doesn't show well, it shows the papers on the top some black you know, I love this one right over here. Is that in here? That'd be. Right here. So I have that. And I always get the 6x6 six six pads. I stopped buying the 12x12s. 12 12s, unless I can't get the 6x6. Six six. Because these little books, I print all my pictures on 2x3. Unless the, it has to be a 4x6. But I usually do a two by three pictures. I print them out. They fit in every one of those things. So some, and I can do like on a four by six, I can put two of them in. And these fit perfect, the six by six. So that's why I get those. Here's the other one I got. This one is Christmas Noel. And it's probably because it had the black in the truck, the black. That's probably why I bought this one. Plus it has red. I'm not too fond of the deer thing, but look at this page right here. Oh, I haven't even opened this yet. Here's my scissors. I just put it in my box when I bought it. I hate those tabs on the side that they use. Okay, well, I kind of ruined the paper. Look at that. Wishing you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. That's going to go on the back page. I can see that already. That will go on the back page. I love that. So, there's my back page. <laughs> um, that's pretty. I haven't looked at this yet. So... I just know that I wanted it. And it's got tags, little tags in here that'll work. Oh, I wish that one, look at that one. Perfect for the front cover. I don't think there's a big page of it though. There's Merry and Bright, a big one. You could use that on a back page. I don't like the green and black one. Oh, I wish they had That's pretty. Anyway, that's fun. And I had these because, is it last year's? I think last year's had some of this in it. But this has what I didn't use. It has the, the black. Definitely using that. I'll pull out of here. This got black snowflakes. 
I know I shouldn't use black for Christmas because it's supposed to be merry, but it's going to be farmhousey. There's a green gingham. I'll use that. There's different uh, reds, golds. I'm not a fan of gold, but I like this. This will be a page in there, probably. Because I always do a candy cane page. And this has got sugar cookies and everything. So this will be a page that I do with Ariel. So it'll be like the gingerbread house or sugar cookies or whatever we make. That will be this page. See, so some of it I can just go through and I know what I'm going to know what I'm gonna do. This kind of sucks. I don't know how it got wet. It didn't ruin it, thank goodness. But this page, this book got... And here's some more of that. And this is some... See, there's the red. I love this. So there's my numbers. If I had to, I would have used these. But I want the wood numbers. And I still might use these like on extra pages, like, you know, for day one or whatever. I'll still use that. So I'll go through each one of these and decide, you know, kind of put pages together. Here's a music one when she was doing her voice uh, choir. Um, it's on the back of a tab. But I would do one page with the music notes because she does. Or maybe I can get her to play her piano for me or whatever. Okay, so I bought these. This is Ephemera Cardabella. This is Echo Park. And these are the little Ephemera things. I bought those. I bought these. I didn't buy a lot because of some of the stuff I already have. Um, let's see. This is a sticker from somebody gave me. I love this. I'm going to use that this, this year. And I bought these sticker pack. This is from Simple Stories. Uh, Merry and Bright. It has a bunch of stickers. Oh, goody, it's got words. I was hoping it would have words. So what do the words look like? Let's see. Some of this got a little bit wet, but not damaged. Thank goodness. I was having a cow. Um, we had a bad thing happen in the basement. And I, the one thing that I should not do is keep my papers over underneath pipes. <laughs> and I should move all that out. But this was on the floor. It happened to be on the floor when I was... Um, yeah, so here's some more numbers. More numbers. I try to use what I have. I don't want to buy anything. I kind of want to use what I have. So I will buy some stuff. The stuff that I bought this year, I think I only paid. I got those two paper pads and the ephemera. I don't know, maybe 25 bucks if that. Plus, I had to get my wood numbers from Dollar Tree. But this, ha oh, this is so cool. It has the, what did I want this for? Oh, I was looking for little stickers for my numbers from my October daily. I have to write them on. I need to get a white ink pen marker. So there's that. So this is papers. Oh, let's go. I still have some stuff in here. Okay. Um, these are the numbers that I was going to use. And this is from an old paper pad that my daughter gave me. I don't even know what it is anymore. But I still have some numbers if I want to use those. So maybe next year I might use these colors. I don't know. I don't know what I'll do next year for Christmas. But this I put all the ephemera stuff in a keep one of these bags. We always have a popcorn night and I printed these out and it actually makes a little popcorn box that you, you can make for parties or whatever. But I keep it, I'm, I think I've used one every year. I think this is my last one. So I'm gonna have to um, copy this again. But I've got a bunch, here's some more of that ephemera I bought. This is, what's this one? Simple Stories, Merry and Bright. I bought a bunch. It was a set. 
end. So I got this one. And then the rest of this was the other one. I've already taken it all apart. And it has all kinds of red and white, black, black farmhouse looking stuff. You know, that's all in here. So, you know, I have that, um, let's see, what's this one? Oh, yes. Love these. These go in my, they go in the little two by three, whatever, the little one. I have a bunch of these, but there's stuff on the other side. So you can do a double, double thing. And I have a bunch of those. Yay. So there's that. Oh, this is fun. What else? Okay. This stuff, I've got some extra. I'm going to put this box down to the top of the desk. I bought, I have extra of these things that I can cut down and reseal if I need more um, insert, insert things. So I'm going to move this box down here. Okay. This I've had. So this is from... Here comes Santa. Um, I've got some dressing. This is the back side. So I could use this. Um, most wonderful time of the year. I love this one. This one I'll use on the 31st or the uh, 24th, whatever. It is the 25th. That'll go in. Um, this has the checker on the back side. More of these. That's what the front looks like. It says... Desk of Santa's official knows you've been naughty or nice. I'm going to use that for Ariel's thing. Here's another one. I like this one. I'll probably use this one. I might use both of those. Anyways, there's that. I had this paper. I just dug out all my red and white, black um, pages. This is white. This is more fancy. Um, Christmas Day. Um, was the night before Christmas. You know, I can use all these. Okay, then we've got this one. And you guys probably know all this. This is Echo Park. Echo Park. Um, I've got two, two different ones of these. This is from American Crafts. This is just like paper paper. I'd have to mount this on something because it's really flimsy. Use this. There's this one, this one's American Crafts. Also, I have two of these. I can use. I have this one right there. The wood grain. Okay. This one. This one. And this one. So, hope you liked it. Have any questions, comment below, and we will see you again soon. Bye now.